how is how do we how do we 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 decouple the idea that th that one you know, th there's this notion that that's the sole source of the problem how do we decouple those ideas well it's not only not the sole source of the problem it's two things to remember the first and most important thing to say is the vast majority of people who are struggling with mental illness never use violence. So let's just say that right at the very beginning. And the truth of the matter is there is no evidence that there's a higher increase or higher incidence of mental illness in America than any other developed country in the world. So this notion that this is the cause of the problem is simply not true. The cause of the problem is the ease at which someone can have access to a firearm. There are more firearms in this country than people. Um, and the reality is uh, even... Uh, when we've proposed legislation that would allow you to make sure that someone with a serious mental illness that is a, that is a danger to themselves or others can't have access to a gun, these red flag laws, even those our Republican colleagues oppose. So that's just not the case. We certainly should do everything we can to make sure people who have mental illness are treated and remove the stigma that's associated with it. And certainly we should make it uh, impossible for someone who's a danger to themselves or others because of that illness to have access to a firearm. That's just part of the solution. The real problem is the easy access to firearms, the fact that they, we are awash with guns, that people can get them uh, at a moment's notice. And, and that's the real problem.